Hey team, I'm on an inspection right now, just uh, looking at a spot where we've got a tankless gas water heater and a gas furnace. And I wanted to show you all where the gas lines come in. Um, this system is missing what's called a drip leg, also known as a sediment trap. I wanna show you what it looks like when there's not one and just kind of talk about that for, for a moment. It's a fairly common find, so it's kind of good to keep an eye out for. So right here, the, the gas lines come in from the wall and then it tees off and goes to the gas water heater with the flex connector. And then over here, it goes up to the gas furnace. Um, typically, typically, it's nice to see a drip leg they, they like to see them, I think, just after the valve. Um, I, I need to recall that. I'm just kind of making this off the cuff. But what, what I want to point out is that <clears throat> the drip leg is normally just a little stub of pipe that sticks down. And it gives a spot for any oil or rust or little bits of debris that might be in the gas lines to fall into. Um, so that they're not as likely to go in and plug up the burners or uh, any of the other equipment inside the mechanic uh, inside the mechanical equipment um, common to not see them very nice to have them so it's always a recommendation we make thank you